I figured, and this is a good lesson for anybody who wants to be an actor. If I do, say, think, feel, and react exactly the way I would think, say, do, feel, and react in that situation, you never have to act. If you are in, if you do say what you would really say and really do and think in that situation, you never have to act. The only time you have to act is when you're, <laughs> you're pretending to do that in that thing. That's how you do it. And that's what I did in that. And that's what I always do. Very good. Very good advice. Very good advice. Very good advice. I want that mask so bad. Damn, I want that mask. That's not a mask. Ah, oh, he says not a mask. <laughs> what mask? As soon as I graduated from school, I'm running away to Hollywood to become a movie star. I said it every single day of my life. I graduated in June, July, August, September, October. I made three bologna sandwiches. I got a $127 check. I went down to the bus station. I wrote a note. I was too afraid to tell my grandparents. So I wrote a note, and I told my grandparents, I'm going to Hollywood to make something out of myself. I left the note at home. And I got on the bus. I was 16, but I looked 10. I was uh, I weighed 75 pounds when I graduated from high school, and I was only 4'11. And and uh, I hit back of the bus, and I asked the guy, "Can I go to Hollywood?" He said, "No." So I'm here in North Carolina. I was young and naive. I thought you had to be an actor to get into Hollywood. But what I didn't find out was. I was actually at a trailway station. Trailways went to 6th and Main Street, the absolute worst street in the entire United States at that time. It was called Skid Row. Still kind of to this day, but it's kind of cleaned up now. But back then, it was the worst street on the entire planet down there, um, except it was in Beirut. And that, and Greyhound went to Hollywood. I didn't know that. So I said, can I, get, can I talk just like this when I got on the bus? And I said, and I said he said, well, you go to Los Angeles. And I said, okay, is the movies in Hollywood? Is it Los Angeles? He said, yes. And I said, I bought it. Never once, never even once did I realize the seriousness of what I had done. Because my entire life, I saw here where I was, and I saw the finish line. And there was no doubt in my mind whatsoever it was going to happen. I knew it in the bottom of my soul. I told everybody who listen. You don't ever let anybody, anybody tell you what you are capable of. Every single person in my entire life told me this, including my mama and all my family told me, you will never make it in the entertainment industry. You're too skinny, you're black, you're poor, and you're ugly. That's what I heard my whole life. Now, I was making straight A's, and a lot of them were saying to me, listen, you, what are you talking about? You can't do that. You can do anything. You make it straight A's. Now, I don't fault them because they were really kind of looking out for me. You know what I'm saying? They were saying, listen, they got actors in New York, Chicago, Atlanta, Philadelphia, Houston, they got agents, managers, warriors, they have acting schools, uh, 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 colleges. How in the hell are you going to go get past them? And I said, I swear to you, I guarantee you it's going to happen. I know it. And that's the difference between making it and not making it. Because if you go to something, people that go out for a dream, if you go and you think you're going to be an actor, you're hoping you're going to be an actor. You want to be an actor. They, they, those are the people who go through what I go through and quit and give up and go back home, end up on a stripper pole, end up selling drugs, end up on drugs, and all those other things. But if you know 100% in your heart and soul that you're going to do something, there ain't shit. There's nothing that can stop you. And nobody can tell you what you can or cannot do. I promise you. So when you went to the theater, how was your inner spirit feeling when you saw it and you saw everybody's reaction? Brother, I swear to you, like I said, I, I'm, I, still, I still have the exact same reactions today. The ex and emotions and excitement and, and about seeing any and everything exactly to the same level and degree as I did when I was 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. When I went to the theater and I saw me in there, I was like, oh my, oh my, I was like, it's like, I did it, I'm in the movies, and everybody was like, yo, you in the Friday night theater? I was like this, it was like, I felt like it was, it was happening. So it was the biggest, I can't even explain it, joy, excitement, it was all of that shit.
you in life when I go, don't be scared. I was took off to be the biggest thing ever. And then Eddie Murphy walks up to me right at the finish that he said, listen to me. And I don't know how the hell he knew this. Who would have thought it? When I said, don't be scared, he goes, if I was you, I would get that live patent and register right now. And he walked around like, what the hell are you talking about? Don't be scared. And I opened and said it 300 times. It had been in every rap song, every rapper done repeated it in this song. All the top rappers in this song. And he was right. And I don't know how the hell he did it. He's one of the geniuses. Who there with y'all? She said, nobody but us. I said, stop lying. And she goes, why? I said, well, who's that other girl? Who's that other person by the door? Walk over by the door. She goes over to the door. And it's just a wall. I said, play the camera back. Call me back. 15 minutes later, police call. They were downstairs. They had to go upstairs. They were not going back in the room, screaming and crying. I had to come to another hotel. And when I show you this video, you're going to see exactly why they did it. I never in my life seen it. As a matter of fact, my hair standing up now. And I don't like showing it. I actually really want it off my phone. And when you see, you'll see why. It's going to make you feel the same way.